Before the discovery of Australia, people in the old world were convinced that all swans were white, an unassailable belief as it seemed completely confirmed by empirical evidence. The sighting of the first black swan might have been an interesting surprise for a few ornithologists, and others extremely concerned with the colouring of birds, but that is not where the significance of the story lies. It illustrates a severe limitation to our learning from observations or experience, and the fragility of our knowledge. Have you ever pictured a world without light? Just think how much we rely on man-made light sources in our lives. Without engineers, we wouldn't be able to live the way we do. No streetlights, no TV, no computer displays, no house light. Engineers design and build all those things. There is no single method of learning that guarantees success. How we learn that depends on many different factors. And what works best for you will not necessarily be that same as the approach used for the other students, even they study the same course. We are all unique as learners, although some patterns emerge any groups of students.
Certainly one of the most important values of literature is that it nourishes our emotional lives. An effective literary work may seem to speak directly to us, especially if we are ripe for it. The inner life that good writers reveal in their characters often gives us glimpses of some portion of ourselves. We can be moved to laugh, cry, tremble, tremble dream, ponder, shriek, or rage with a character by simply turning a page instead of turning our lives upside down. Education began in prehistory, as adults trained the young in the knowledge and skills deemed necessary in their society. In preliterate societies, this was achieved orally and through imitation. In most contemporary educational systems of the world, secondary education comprises the formal education that occurs during adolescence. It, it is characterized by transition from the typically compulsory comprehensive primary education for minors to the optional selective tertiary, post-secondary, or higher education for adults. Teenage girls are continuing to outperform boys in English, while the gender gap in achievements in mathematics and science has almost disappeared. The figures show that last year 80% of 14-year-old girls reached at least the expected level 5 in English, compared with 65% of boys. But in mathematics, the, the girls are just 1% ahead of boys, while in science the difference is 2%.
Imagine living all your life as the only family on your street. Then, one morning, you open the front door and discover houses all around you. You see neighbors tending their gardens and children walking to school. Where did all the people come from? What if the answer turned out to be that they had always been there you just hadn't seen them? I would imagine that most of our students are either Japanese or Chinese. I would imagine that most of our students are either Japanese or Chinese. Anyone who has a problem with their accommodation should speak to the welfare officer. Anyone who has a problem with their accommodation should speak to the welfare officer. Make sure the financial director knows the full details of the pay agreement. Make sure the financial director knows the full details of the pay agreement. We have to travel too far to reach Hill Park. We have to travel too far to reach Hill Park. Here is only one example, but there are lots of others. Here is only one example, but there are lots of others. Hypothetically, insufficient mastery in these areas slows future progress. Hypothetically, insufficient mastery in these areas slows future progress.
it seems that there are choices available online. It seems that there are choices available online. Would you like to videotape our lecture? Would you like to videotape our lecture? I must see him before he flies out to London for about a week. I must see him before he flies out to London for about a week. In 1830, periodicals appeared in large numbers in America. In 1830, periodicals appeared in large numbers in America. The bus picks us up at 8.30 a.m., and then it's an hour and a half on the road. The bus picks us up at 8.30 a.m., and then it's an hour and a half on the road. Your advice last week about writing summaries was very useful. Your advice last week about writing summaries was very useful.
The given bar graph represents the information about media in the UK. According to the graph, there are four main sources of media such as internet, radio, TV and newspaper in three different years. The maximum number can be seen in internet which is 60% in the year of 2005 as, comp as compared to radio, TV and newspaper. On the other hand, in the year of 2001, radio was the most popular medium of communication which was around 63% compared to other years. TV and newspaper were almost the same in all the given three years. The given image shows the information about both poor and correct sitting postures. If you sit like a slump, then your shoulders roll forward and your chin poke forward towards the laptop screen, which is considered as wrong sitting posture. In order to maintain a proper sitting posture, the top of your screen should be at eye level. Moreover, or over, you need to sit still and the chair should completely support your back. Overall, we can say that the image shows the crucial information about both poor and proper sitting postures respectively. The given image shows the information about trout fish size. According to the image, we can see the fish of different age groups with different sizes. One-year-old fish size is around 10 to 30 centimeters. After three years, the size of the fish is around 10 to 40 centimeters. Moreover, once the fish is eight, is eight years old then the size goes up to 50 centimeters. Once the fish grows up to 15 years old, the size can go up to 60 centimeters. Overall, we can say that trout fish sizes are very well explained.
The following graph gives information about the graduation laboratory. According to the image, we can see that the information of different areas are displayed on the map. At the central area, there are storage and toilets. At the left area, there are animal sciences room. According to this graph, the largest area is of plant plant sciences. In comparison, the smallest area is of different offices. There are computer station and meeting room, shown on the map. In conclusion, we can say that the given map is very well explained. We're thinking about this and we're trying to say, all right, well, let's file a patent on this clicker. If I were to go to the patent office and say, all right, I want a patent on a clicker, period, the patent office would just laugh. You know, the clickers have been around for a while, presentation clickers have been around for a while, and so there'd be a 0% zero percent, zero percent <coughs> chance that we would actually get that. If we were to somehow convince the patent office that we should be able to get a patent on a clicker, period, it would, however, be incredibly valuable. Every single p clicker that was um, made after this point would infringe. And when it infringes, maybe we take a one or two dollars each. And that would add up to be a decent amount of money. On the other end of the spectrum, let's go to the million word version. I go to the patent office and I say, I want a patent on this exact thing. And those million words describe every single radius, every single um, uh, material, every single thing about this. And the patent office says, yeah, we've never seen that before. Go ahead and take it. Almost 100% chance of getting that patent. But the value of that patent would be close to zero. The speaker talks about filing a patent, and he used a clicker as an example. According to the speaker, clicker is not a new thing, there will be a very less chance to get a patent. But, if you manage to get one, which will be very valuable, you can gain more money from it. If you describe every material and aspect of the clicker, you, you are 100% to get the patent. However, the value of the patent will be close to zero. It is wrong, however, to exaggerate the similarity between language and other cognitive skills, because language stands apart in several ways. For one thing, the use of language is universal all normally developing children learn to speak at least one language, and many learn more than one. By contrast, not everyone becomes prof proficient at complex mathematical reasoning, few people learn to paint well, and many people cannot carry a tune. Because everyone is capable of learning to speak and understand language, it may seem to be simple. But just the opposite is true language is one of the most complex of all human cognitive abilities.
the lecture talks about the differences between language learning and other cognitive skills learning. The use of language is universal used and all developing children learn to speak as least one language, even more than one. Not everyone becomes proficient at other cognitive skills, such as mathematical reasoning, painting or carrying a tune a tune. The universal use of language makes it capable of learning simply. Language is one of the most complex human cognitive skills. How would you describe the process by which snow becomes water? Tones, kilograms, and stones measure what property? What are the people who study history and historical evidence? What can bring astronauts to space? What is the act of students being present at school? What is the occupation that transfers one language to another language?
Why are bees so important to agriculture? How many wheels does a tricycle have?